Hi, what's up guys? Uh, today we have a review of the Nokia 2. Uh, to be honest with you, I was surprised with this phone uh, uh, more than I'm disappointed because it has some very good features and very good checkboxes. Like for example, uh, as you know, we're going to go through the scoring criteria, which is first off is the design and second is the performance. So design wise, look at this. That's a metal. And for that price giving for the Nokia 2, having a metal unibody on the edges really help your phone to last longer. And that's one of the things that I really, really, really appreciate when it comes to uh, building quality and, uh, you know, having uh, a quality assurance for the customers. Uh, that's when it comes to the build quality. The back is plastic, but it's okay. You know, it doesn't matter. The phone when it falls is gonna fall usually on the edges or on the face. So when it, when it even hits the back, it's it's plastic. You know, it's not a big deal. You can just change it. It's not a big deal. It's not like glass or any of the new phones, <coughs> the premium phones. Excuse me. Um, so the design is really good. It's well well balanced. We have the micro USB. We have two speaker uh, two speakers here. Two uh, excuse me two uh, microphones, one microphone here, one microphone in the back. Uh, the speaker is on the back here. And to be honest with you, uh, the sound is not that much of a big deal. If you're here to just listen to, uh, to a podcast, it'll be fine. But for you to listen to music is not that good of a speaker. So you can just use it for uh, speaker phones and anything. It's not, you're not gonna be uh, enjoying it like, like other premium speakers. Uh, we have the uh, headphone jack here available. Uh, it's really good. And what else we have? Uh, we have the cameras. The cameras are just, you know what I'm saying, it's it's placed in a good. It's it's okay, you know. The place is, I mean, it's a, it's a, it's a normal design. It's not, there's no something, something crazy about these cameras. Uh, they are... <laughs> They are just below average, to be honest with you. The camera is not that good, so you you you're not gonna take pictures of any other places like you going out. The, the color seems like washed out. Um, you know, it's not even close to the mid ranger cameras. So you take if you want to take picture with this, you just take pictures like for. Uh, uh, business cards or any other things is just for you to read or just to keep for yourself. It's not for to show it to anybody. So it's not that good. Same thing with the selfie. It's not that big deal. I don't know why they put selfie with that quality. So yes, it's 8, me 8 megapixel in the back, 5 megapixel in the front, but still the quality is really horrible. Maybe a software update in the Oreo could improve it. I don't know about Nokia. Maybe we can do that. Anyways, let's go to the software. Uh, the screen. Okay, this is one. What's what's really uh, impressed me about this phone is the screen. It's 720p, but it's a, it's a good high quality screen. To be honest with you, and for that price, you're getting a screen with a good in color co co contrast and the color produ uh, production. It's really good, and uh, to be honest with you, the white looks really white. The uh, red looks really red. It's even pops out like it's it's in a vivid mode. Uh, of some sort but to be honest with you the colors I really enjoy the colors uh, it's a good quality 720p panel that's it uh, so let's go to the software so as you can see uh, smoothness so the software seems like it is okay uh, there is some kind of lag sometimes but I'll let you see and maybe experience how fast and smooth the, uh, the software experience. So uh, if I if I would open, for example, calculator, see how much time it takes. So real world experience, we're just going to open and see how much time it takes. So uh, there might be some little bit of time or lag due to that 212 Snapdragon uh, processor, which is the lowest of the low. But at the same time, it's the, I would call it the <laughs> the most energy efficient, to be honest with you. Because I spend my time watching uh, videos and uh, calling and stuff. 
I want to show you the better life. Check out the better life. Now it's 3% left, okay? See the graph and how it's actually sucking out the battery. I'm going to show you the details on the screen of time. Oh, actually it is. So if you go to the screen on time, you'll notice there is I spent seven hours and four minutes uh, on the screen on time. So this is where the screen always playing. And uh, still I have three three percent. So let's just say maybe around seven hours and uh, let's just say it's gonna turn off on 720, seven and a half probably. I don't know, I'm gonna check it out. So around 15, 20 minutes later, it's gonna turn off. So that's in my book is a good better life. So there's a 4,100 milliamp battery and it's actually very good performance. Uh, let's go to the uh, fun idle. So two days, 16 hours. So time on two days, 16 hours, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, this is when uh, my phone and idle, regardless if it's open or turned off. So it's, it's always on. So that's where it was uh, since charging. And by the way, just so you know, that was when I <laughs> when I had it, 77%. So count 77% until now, and this is what I get. So I guess around, if you do the math, so around 100%, it might give you 25%. So because, uh, so 25% of this, it might give you around um, nine hours around nine hours and something screen on time which is really good to be honest with you with the budget phone ah uh, yeah that's a good good phone by the way when if you want if you want to watch media i think that's why they actually had this uh uh this screen because a 720p screen and with a media consumption of very low uh uh, processor that would give you a longer longer battery life than other phones to be honest with you this is i think it's what uh, nokia intended to have this phone for but this for this uh price is really good now what the con let's talk about the cons yeah the uh storage so the storage is around eight gigabyte of storage it's not gonna fill anything for you 8 gigabyte and you have 1 gigabyte of RAM so the RAM now is around 500 uh, megabytes it takes around 500 if you play if you're opening two apps around 500 so if you're opening three you will notice stuttering around more than like four apps so if you put four and five apps like around that four five three four five you'll start finding out that the phone is really really slowing down now uh so yeah that's the con the uh, ram but when it comes to the storage you can have micro sd card uh and you can go from there but still eight gigabyte if it's very very low for you you might might you know get you might fill it up just from the updates application updates because some application has 100 megabytes to 200 uh, 150 some some of them have 50 megabytes so it depends on the applications that you have it's gonna cost uh, more and more uh, space on your phone uh, phone calls are really good uh, it's okay you can hear the other person it's fine but do not use the speakers not this is not gonna help you out in your phone calls because uh, from my experience if you're just talking to someone from uh, from this range, where I'm holding the phone, I'm expecting them to, you know, get my sound. Or I listen to them better than uh, they listen to me. But I cannot hear them, to be honest, because the speaker in the back, it covers my hand, and I cannot hear them in the speaker. Uh, on the other hand, they hear me really good. So they, they, they hear my sound because they have two microphones up and down. The sound become really good. It's like 360 sound, but on the back, there's the speaker is muffled, so blocked, so I cannot really hear them. Uh, so this is one of the thing. Uh, regarding signal quality, Wi-Fi is really good. To be honest with you, uh, I didn't I didn't face any problems. Flashlights. Oh, that's really flashy. <laughs> so yeah, that's it. To be honest with you, this this phone. 
really rocks and uh, if you want to play video games just skip this video game it's, gonna, it's not gonna play good to be honest with you I know I said the word to be honest a lot in this review so let's conclude thank you guys and if you like this review please like it if you'd like to subscribe please subscribe share it with your friends I'm gonna make a lot of uh, phone comparison later on uh, people who are concerned about the speakers I'm going to test this phone speakers with other flagship speakers so you can uh, you know compare between each one of them when it comes to the sound quality please like the video subscribe hope you guys have fun and uh, enjoy see you guys later